right, guys. Hey, this is Bill. Uh, this week we're looking at DracolinoBJJTraining.com, uh, which is a video training website. Uh, it's very cool. Uh, we're going to show you kind of some of the the library of techniques that they've got and what they what they're doing here. Um, right off on the first page, you notice they've got the iPhone uh, application. Um, for somebody like me, I'm a little slow on the uptake sometimes, and that's really cool because uh, it, it would be nice to be able to be on the mat, try a technique. You know, if I don't get it right away, I can look at the uh, right on the phone because I've got it in my bag and and see the video two or three times, and then go right back out and try it. Even if it's uh, even if I watch a video an hour or two before class, a lot of times it's hard for me to remember everything by the time it's 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 I'm ready to try. So I think that's pretty cool. Um, and you get the iPhone application if you sign up for their for their program. Um, another thing is, uh, we'll click here. Uh, a lot of times with this online videos and things, you don't really know uh, who you're getting your information from. So um, you could be getting bad technique. Uh, you just don't know. Definitely not a problem here. I mean, Dracolino's the real deal. He's a fourth degree black belt under Carlos Gracie Jr. Um, he started with his training with Jean-Jacques Machado. He's been teaching for 18 years. He's a decorated competitor. He's got the MMA pro fights to his name. Matter of fact, he's training for one right now. Uh, he's got a bunch of world-class black belt uh, competitors that he's, you know, that are his students. Uh, so the jiu-jitsu that you're going to get is, is absolutely uh, world-class, so no question about that. All right, when you log in, uh, you go to their training center. And... Um, uh, on the training center, one of the cool things it's got is uh, is it's got the uh, this technique search. So uh, if you want to just look real quick for let's say uh, you want uh, submissions for mount, you put your position in, uh, you put the type of, of video that you want, you hit search, um, and there you go. Uh, there's all the submissions for mount that they've got here. Uh, if you check out the full library. Um, looks like they've got about 400 or so different techniques here, all sorted by position and type. Um, so let's let's just go ahead and and, uh, and take a look. I'm going to go back. I want to look at this uh, simple cross choke from mount. Okay, and. Uh, you can see that it's got a good clear video. Uh, it's got the three different camera angles, so you can see what's going on on the back uh, and on the on, on both sides. Um, it's got a little button here. You can add stuff to your favorites, so you can collect the stuff that you like to do. Um, it's got variations, counters, and some of these videos will have similar uh, techniques. So you could get a bunch of different stuff here depending on what you're doing, but it is nice at right here. So you want to see a counter to the cross uh, choke? you know it's right there um, and you click on it and it goes right to the video so um, it's also got your key points down here um, it's got a, a forum that you can click on so if you're having trouble with something you can go into the forum um, so I'm gonna let the uh, video play for just a minute and you can get a get a feeling for it alright guys the X show with the mouth maybe one of the most basic techniques that you, you can have. You learn this on one of the first lessons in Jiu-Jitsu. However, this is a really effective technique. You see that uh, the last World Championships in 2009, uh, Roger Gracie won nine of his nine fights by uh, choke submission from the mound. And maybe like 80% of that were the X choke, the simple X choke, okay? So it is, yes, really effective. So I got here in the mouth position. I wanna make sure that I bother him. So sprawl your knees just a little bit, just to make sure that your hip gets really heavy. Okay, now, one of your hands, you're not going to be legged if your hands very busy. You're just going to have one of them just to make sure that you offer a little bit of room to come like a rocket, like a ray, like a lightning with your hand crossing like that. It's important, guys, that this part of your hand is going to be really close to his neck. Okay, I'm not gonna be like a grip out and then I try to adjust later because this little room can be fatal for you. Okay, so you open with this one and that one goes really fast, just touching the side of his neck and then going all the way there. Once you reach, almost reach actually, the very back part of his neck, that same hand that opened now, bring it close and you adjust. Okay, a lot of people say, oh, it's not good for you to have both hands busy. I disagree with that because this hand is really easy for me to release if I need to and that is essential for you to give that little room to adjust that collar there. So, 
So one of the great things uh, about uh, Dracolina's instruction is that, uh, you know, he's, he's a funny guy. He's got a great personality. He's got a lot of energy. Uh, he's given a ton of detail. Uh, and uh, so it all makes the videos uh, a lot of fun and really easy to watch. Um, so uh, in every video that I've seen, he's been doing the instruction. Um, and and uh, again, he's just he's just a he's just a fun guy to listen to. I bet he'd be uh, great to go to a seminar or or, or you know to, to have in class. This blue belt section uh, features uh, Dracolino talking some about uh, what he feels is important for uh, for the road to blue belt and giving you some recommended techniques. Um, so that's nice. Uh, uh, also, you've got the curriculum. If you are uh, a school, um, you can actually go. It's got uh, both the basic techniques and advanced techniques day by day, and they send you some information about, uh, about those to just to keep you on track. Um, it's got a blog, and actually, uh, you should go check out the blog uh, just because, uh, like I said, the guy's, the guy's pretty funny. Um, definitely want to check out his uh, his his video blog on uh, on uh, talking about Eddie Bravo. It's 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 amusing. All right. So overall impressions. Uh, the site's really professionally done. Uh, the jiu jitsu is world class. Dracolino is a great instructor. He's fun to listen to. The video quality is good. The audio quality is good. Uh, the navigation of the site is is really intuitive and and easy. Um, uh, they've got the great iPhone application so that you can take the stuff with you. Um, I definitely think it's something uh, that's worth your time to go over and check out and see if it's uh, going to help you uh, with your jiu-jitsu. So I uh, hope you liked the review. Again, we were looking at BJJTraining.com, and this is Bill with BJJWeekly.com.